co-terminal angles, <coughs> also known as same position. So I just showed you guys a graphic where basically we started on the initial at zero degrees and it did a full rotation of a positive angle and ended up in the same position, same position, at 360 degrees. That's called a co-terminal angles. Here's our formal definition. Angles that have the same initial side and the same terminal side but have different measures. So let me talk about this uh, conceptually. So if you start at the initial side in standard position between quadrants 1 and 4, and let's say you move in this direction here, and I call that alpha. <coughs> That's a positive angle. Class, I've, if I move in this direction, I use the same color. If I use this direction, what angle is that class? It's a negative angle. Someone said beta, right? Notice how if I start here at the initial, so it has the same initial and also has the same terminal. Angles A and B are called coterminal angles. Let's try another example. If I start down here on the initial side, standard position, Let's just say I form an acute angle. Well, if I do a positive angle, call that alpha, or I can go the other direction. In this case, clockwise, which forms a negative angle. Notice how they end up in the same position. So here's my analogy, my illustration. Over here we are in the math wing. All of us teachers are math teachers. Some teachers may have went to one university, some teachers went to four universities. But we've just all, we're all, we've all finished to become math teachers. We end up in the same position. Some of you will take four years to graduate college. Some of you might need to work during that time. Maybe it takes you six years. Some of you might start it and complete it 20 years later, but the idea is that you've graduated college, okay? So those are my real life examples of co-terminal angles.